All right. All right, here we go. Uh, so we said a lot about this during winners finals. You know, was, we played. There's four games of this matchup specifically in winners yeah. finals. We talked a lot about this. Um, I don't know if there's much for us to say, so we'll just kind of play by play it, and you know, add a little couple things in there as we go. I guess is the best way we can do. So, okay, I'm down with that. There's cherries again. This is, he did the same thing against him, and winners finals too was like he has he doesn't ever throw cherries and throw cherries against him again. So I don't know what that's about. On the same stage, in the same position, um, <laughs> both players are just going at it right now. Um, still maintaining the same strategy. Uh, Pac Man just trying to get his fruit off. Blue Beast trying to stop that from happening. Not going for the Hydrant bait, which I think he left there as kind of a bait. Yeah, Blue Beast trying to just fill a bunch of negative space. Throws Hydrant. Forward air, good back air. Goes for a down smash after the Hydrant push. Throws an orange, trying to get a little uh, shield pressure going. Lays a trampoline trap. Goes for another Hydrant. Gonna go ahead and pop the Hydrant. Yeah, which was Ooh, smart. That was good. Um, and uses the trampoline to push back. Throws a nice little orange there. Gets Apple, which I kind of figured he'd get Apple there because it was uh, coming in that angle. Mm hmm. Goes for the nice back air, and this is one of those situations again where Blue Beast. Nice. How I don't know why he rolled that. I don't. He probably just saw it, didn't register it. Um, Blue Beast taking a lot more damage than he probably should want be taking damage right now because he, you know, ooh, nice little footstool neutral there. Yeah. Hip and I throw out jabs, trying to get what he needs. Gets a Galga. He definitely wants something else though. I don't think he's gonna throw a Galga here. Nice, gets it out. Oh, goes for just a really cheeky, like, hey, maybe if he's fast falling, I'll get enough smash out of it. Uh, gets key entirely. Yep, has key. Throws key away. Did not mean to, for sure. Unless he was really baiting out that back air. Yeah. Which would be insane. That'd be just insane if he's, like, trying to throw a key backwards so he can just get a back air. Like, I don't know, man. The guy's on another level. Who knows? Throws key, hits Hydrant. Uh, still going out for a good neutral air by. And you see how like, fast fell out of that mm -hmm. right afterwards because he wanted to get grounded arrows out as fast as technically possible. Gets arrows out, stops the Galga. Tries to go for that down smash to stop to get the uh, soft spot of the um, side B again, which he did if he bonked. He did that in Winter's Finals. When he bonked, he just got him with a down B, so, or uh, down smash. Mm -hmm. Both players at really high percent right now. Both players have to fish for some sort of kill here. Um, Seeing Pac-Man at that high percent with an orange in hand, I might have gone for the snipe myself with the more charged arrow. Yeah. Granted, he just got the kill with back air, though. Yeah, so. he did get the kill. Has Apple. He wants to kill him with Apple. Tries to kill him with Apple, yeah. It's either Key or Apple at this point, maybe even Hydrant. Any one of those three will kill, no problem. Yeah. Yeah, he didn't have a jump. He actually didn't have a jump coming off of that because of the Hydra pushed him off. He really wants to get a kill here. Watch out for that down B because I think it's going to be coming out pretty soon. Get, ooh, ooh, ooh. It's getting dicey up I in didn't, here. I wasn't going to say oh. he got the key. I was going to say he got the key off, but I didn't think he was. We got DI, apparently. Throws out the bell. Goes for another cheeky setup. Nice. Good Good job on Bluebees there by backing up, dis disengaging from the, uh, from the entire conflict and then just side being right back into it. He's getting quality damage out right now, which is exactly what um, Hippo doesn't need, but that's perfectly okay. Throws out the apple, and because he was stuck in arrow, ended up taking it. But 67% is nothing to, nothing to joke about. Like, it was really good that he got all that percent off. Absolutely. Also, shoutouts, just, just a heads up, just for so everybody knows, when, when commentary happens, like, always try to finish your thought, even if something else happens. It just, it, yeah. it's just better. Go for the down beat. Right now, he's just, oh, he was trying to, yeah, he was trying to just uh, down B the, um, or reflect the Hydra. Just cherries again, up throw. Just doing that to get more arrows off. He's not too worried about Hydra coming down on him. He also could just down B the Hydra on its way down as well, just to, I don't know, maybe a little mix up. Could but, be, unless he unless he mistimes it a little bit or just misreads oh, yeah, it. Oh, yeah, yeah, because if it drops head, right yeah, on yeah, his yeah, head, yeah, it'll, yeah, it'll still I head forgot, up. I forgot, I forgot. Yeah. <laughs> mm, Goes for a smash. Throwing a few more things out than I thought. And hit him with the Alan Oop. Yeah, he, the Alan Oop. Yeah, hit him with the Alan Oop. <laughs> he did. That's another reason I love Pit. So, really good on Blue Beast there, showing that he still knows and understands the yeah. matchup. Which I think is a little interesting, but uh, we'll see how that works out. I think he won, he won here, didn't he? No, 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 no. He stage spiked him on um, Smash Roll. Yeah, that or TNC. Blue Beast going dangerous on us. Okay. <laughs> Seen a little bit of a different approach from Hippo Knight this time. In what way? I just saw him uh, just run in and start doing uh, aerials. Okay. I hadn't really seen him do. Well, he just did, he just did a down throw. Uh, he did a down throw into a, a dash attack using the hydrant. So yeah, he's definitely changing it up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Which is something I think he does need to do. He might be trying to go a little bit more of an aggressive route, um, but maybe he doesn't have the frame data to do it. In a sense, you know what I mean? That's true. Especially against somebody as aggressive that Nespit can be. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
nice space in the back there, but because the active frame stood out there for so long, he got punished after using it because it was a soft spot. So it's not even fair. Like, it was a good move, but just wasn't, you know, just didn't come out the right way. Nice neutral air. Uh, now he's starting to set up his traps. He's got, he's got key right now. Baited it, did not punish. Ooh, but you know, he's at, he saw him shielding. Mm -hmm. So I get the B reverse, which is well, usually my setup, just B reverse, whatever, and hopefully they'll break shield because they don't, they think you're not going to be near him, you know. Goes hydrant down again. The hydrant down on the second arrow, I think, was a pretty decent cover, though. It's also pretty cool because hydrant disappears so fast that you can throw another one before they know you can actually throw another one. Yeah. Because it just, it's already disappeared. Nice forward throw. Not going to kill yet, but another one probably will, especially if he's close to the ledge. <sighs> Getting dangerous. Getting dangerous. So there's uh, two of those down smashes. Uh, hydrant saving his life there. Uh, probably planned, though. He probably knew it was, but just didn't have an answer for what he wanted to do out of it. Smash so close already. <laughs> Absolutely. Both at 120%. So close. Trying to fill negative space. Throws out cherries. Uh, I see he's throwing cherries because it comes out really fast. Like, it's his first option. Just kind of, like, be reverse cherry. Right. But it's been shielded every single time, so, you know, Bluebeast just playing that nice defensive truck. Ooh, if he rolled into that... Ooh, gets the side B, though. Even if he back aired there, it's just, the armor would have took it on that um, dash upper. Right? Dash upper? Uh, upper dash arm. It's okay. We're here to learn. <laughs> We're here to learn. <laughs> So Blue Beast um, gets another side B, gets on stage 10%. Um, right now, Hippo Knight just needs to clear out the stock. So he gets, he goes and gets gets the fruity once, gets the apple. Yeah, good job being careful of your own hydrant there because it almost got uh, knocked into you. Yeah, you don't want to be giving him any more free damage. Okay, gets an up. See, this is the thing. Like, Pac-Man's normals are just so weak. What, is, does, he, does he have a kill throw? No. Yeah. So, so back he just goes, throw. Is it back throw? Yeah, it would have been back oh, throw, yeah. but maybe not in the... Uh, I should have at this... Uh, at, this uh, at this percentage, it's definitely going to kill it. Not from where he was, not though. From not the, from where he was. Yeah, from, that's why he probably just didn't do it, so... Yeah. Just want to get extra damage. That's a like, scary thing. Oh, he's fishing. Hate to see people fish like that. Hate to see him fish like that. That was interesting. Hitboxes collide. And then we see oh, Blue Beast in firm control right now. Damn oh, it. forward throw. Oh, trying to snipe him. Man after my own heart. Oh, stops the side B, but luckily we got that up B trampoline. <laughs> he's still not. Battlefield we live in. Smash 4. Got the key. If it gets reflected, he's dead himself. Oh, yeah. yeah. Which is what's insane right now, because he's in such a uh, high-pressure situation. Forward throw? Forward throw probably would have killed. But I'm, li I'm liking this uh, more than the last match, though, even though he's a little bit more behind than before, I think. Yeah. Uh, he's looking like Hippo Knight's in a lot more control than before. Or at least uh, more control of himself. Right now, anyway, yeah. yeah. I mean, but he's got so much work to do. Mm -hmm. It took him almost 200% to get the kill last time. I mean, it's this is, a, this is a time and numbers game right now. We saw Weavile duck out of this just for this reason alone, you know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, this is such a time and numbers game forward throw. Luckily, won't kill yet. Got some quality jabs out there. There's the Apple Snipe from, uh, from the Nether Realm. Nice. His grab, that wasn't even fair. His grab frame just started just, up way too yeah. short, and he just got double down smash. Um, yeah, uh, Baker's dozen is 13. I, I know, I keep, trust me, I keep saying it. I've C2, been saying it since 7. Like, C2C on oh, we are seeing that younger ninja. Actually, I've been saying Baker's dozen since 6, and I'm going to keep saying it until we actually get to it. All right, so we got the younger ninja right now. This is 2-0, Bluebeast favor. All he has to do is win one more to take this to be 3-0 and take the grand final set. If not... Um, Hippo Knight needs to really make a huge comeback here to reset this bracket. Mm -hmm. Last time he brought out Greninja, he didn't play it very well, right? I no. mean, he just kind of got controlled by the negative space. Bluebeast playing real zone heavy right now, too, which is really interesting. Um, as I said, that he turns it up. So let's see if, um, if Hippo Knight brings something out here. I feel like he just... I want to say that his, um, Greninja just didn't have a chance to do anything last time he played it. So maybe we'll see a little difference here. Maybe he'll actually... That's why I, I was saying before that I think he was just kind of observing how that matchup would maybe go, see some of the stuff he was doing, because yeah. I think he was confident he was going to make it back into Grand. Yeah, oh yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, facing a little bit of lag there, but it seems to be cleared up now. A little bit. A little bit. A little bit. Until you mentioned it. Yeah, I know. Um, but yeah, so it's like, maybe he just didn't have a chance, maybe he was just kind of like, false starting a little bit, mm -hmm. and we'll see if he gets anything out of it. Got to disagree with those uh, down airs he keeps using, though. Uh, when when you're on the rise up, it's okay because okay. you're not you're not unsafe really, unless you get back aired by Falcon or something like that. Both players dealing with a little bit of lag right now. Uh, really random sudden lag too. Not really sure why that's there. Keeps happening in Grand Finals, doesn't it? Yeah, it's just really ah Blue Beast. That's twice now Grand Finals lag. Uh, I kind of have to blame you, right? Uh, side <laughs> B <laughs> uh, gets a side B. Um, right now, 
Yeah, he's having trouble dealing with the lag a little bit uh, as Greninja. Although, was that a jump or a win box from the down smash? I think it was a win box from down smash. Water box? Water box. Otter box. Otter box. Nice. Protect your gear. Sponsor us, please. Otter box is pretty cool. Alright, so. He also, um, if the lag holds up off ledge, like not off ledge, but he can also give Pitt's recovery mm -hmm. using Pretty up heavily. I was just yeah, about to say that. Using water spout to actually. Um, to give that recovery. That's more the only my, thing is he has to pull him off the stage first. Yeah, that's my biggest fear as in the Falcon matchup because it's so good against me. I have to recover high and then they just... Yeah. Ooh, that was, that was really good. risky because he would have lost uh, invincibility there and would have easily sucked the down smash as fast as possible. So, good stuff. Uh, still maintaining right now. Both characters need to go for some random smash though to get a kill or side or, B like that. Or side B from him too. Or the poor man's raptor boost. Yeah. Actually, I think it's better. It has armor, so it's more useful mid-match. Oh, okay. Just That's as a right. kill. Nice. I love the forward throw dash attack from Pit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. it gets the side smash. Okay. okay. So, right now, it's it's really even. This is 2-0. Bluebee's looking to close this out so that he can send everybody home. And, and Hippo Knight have... looking to extend it because he knows we like seeing these matches. Absolutely. So, uh, good luck both players. Good. Yeah, absolutely. Hippo Knight, um, Hamlin from New Jersey. Fun fact? That's all I got for you. Okay. <laughs> Straight out of New Jersey. And then, oh, just Blue Beast in complete control right now. Right, right now, he's just, he's having his way. Ooh, okay. Get the gentleman. Good stuff. Going for that ambitious, ambitious counter. <sighs> that was risky. Yeah, I mean, he should have, he should have got the kill on it. Blue Beast looking around for the forward throw. The recovery on the down smash with Pit is just so ridiculous, fast. man. So fast. Ooh, goes for the forward tilt, misses it. Man, Hippo and I still playing really aggressive right now. Forward throw, up throw? Okay. That's Because forward throw wouldn't have killed him. Yeah, I, I almost figured he had a back throw just for the sake of back throwing. You know, like, it's not going to really do anything, but. Yeah. The positioning. The armor. The armor. The armor takes it. the down tilt. So. I was, I was kind of hoping. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Two German's in a row. claws. Yeah. I was Blue hoping beast. to see a comeback there. Blue Beast on the, on, the, on the twice in a row, taking C2C online 9 and 